Today we're going to troubleshoot a blacked out radio on a Mercedes 2014 C250. All right, so we have this 2014 Mercedes C250 and I checked all the fuses in the engine bay. I checked all the fuses in the trunk. They're all good. So I took the next step and I opened up the radio. I pulled out the radio, disconnected all the pigtails from it. There's the fuse in here which isn't anymore because I want to go get a replacement. Well, I sent someone to go get a replacement for me. And there's a fuse 10A and that fuse was popped. So now I'm going to replace it with a new one and we'll see if this radio works. All right, so here are the fuses. There you can see that one's blown and there's the new one. We're actually going to do a little upgrade to the radio. That way this doesn't happen again. Uh, the stock one takes a 10. There it is. Not anymore. It's going to take a 20. If it wants to focus. Anyways, you're going to have to take my word for it. It's a 20 now. So anyways, I'm going to go ahead and stick this into the fuse holder right here there it is i'm going to go ahead and plug everything back in all right so let's go ahead and turn it on now and see if this is going to work and it did sweet let's go ahead and press on and there it is radio is working now it wasn't working before and now it is and that is how you fix that Thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe. In order to figure out how to take all this out, make sure you watch out my video of how to remove a radio on a Mercedes 2014 C250. Thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe. All right, since you guys didn't watch how to remove this, I'm gonna demonstrate how to put it back on. All right, so we're gonna go ahead and slide this back into its position. Make sure all these wires are tucked in. All right, go ahead and secure that all the way. There's two torque screws that are gonna go here and here on this side. All right, once you have both of those screws secured, we're gonna grab our vents. We're gonna connect our pigtail right in there. All right, and just line everything up and smack it into place. There it is. And that is how you fix the radio on a 2014 Mercedes C250. Thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe. Don't forget to hit that bell. All right, let's get out of here before we get kicked out.